It's yet another beautiful day here in the Pearl of Africa. Welcome back. Our guest today is the Samsung J6 Plus. This is the phone in which I instructed you on how to replace the screen. Now it is here and I'm going to show you how to secure the screen onto the frame. Welcome back to Phone Lookout. Hit the subscribe button and always return. And uh, this phone is actually not glued in yet. And that's we what we are going to do just right now. And right now it is plugged in. So uh, first course of action is to remove this, clean the peripheries, and then apply adhesive on both surfaces, bring them together and bond them. Now they are going to bring our adhesive and it's usually isopropyl alcohol that we use to help in our cleaning. Um, because it is volatile as much as capable of dissolving any organic dirt. So we get our little bit of tissue, or in this case a piece of fabric, and uh, get back right in. Oh, by the way, if you're here, this is an archive of repairs and uh, things to do with phones. I hope that you will always enjoy your stay here. I uh, promised, promised some reviews, but uh, I think it's a bit expensive to get hands-on brand new phones. And anyway, at times I would be found to do impressions, my impressions about new gadgets, uh, about the specifications that are out, and see what you guys think about it. If the kind of content you guys would be alright consuming, then that would work for me. Now, I have to apply adhesive on the frame of the phone. So we are going to begin from the top side. And uh, okay, like that. All right. Okay. Like that. Bring it like that. To the end and then also this side I mean this is a perfect adhesive to use because it tends to form the most perfect bond between it and the other adhesives are found on the market so I'm just going to fill in those blanks right there and that should be all right and then some parts of that and some parts of there Having done that, we bring our screen itself and also do the same for it. So we're going all along the length of the phone. The screen are coming all the way to down. Anyway, um, if you're here for the first time, please do hit the subscribe button. And this is just to show you that some of these things that you guys revere are actually very doable. The only challenge is getting things that are required from the right places and the right qualities. And then maybe a few precautions, things to precautions, things you need to be aware of while performing this exercise. And uh, I think the most difficult part is removing the screen, but placing is relatively straightforward or easy. And then, yeah, it shouldn't really suffer you. Anyway, let me give it a few minutes to partially evaporate and then uh, I bond it. So I'm giving it two minutes and in that moment, uh, please do hit the subscribe button. I noticed as the glue is drying that uh, this fiber is supposed to lock in place with the locking mechanism, but I misplaced it. So I'm going to cut a piece of uh, a sponge like material to just allow me be able to have the screen do the pressing so the fiber doesn't jump out in the event of an impact. Anyway, if you're new here, please do hit the subscribe button. And I'm really grateful to all of you who are already subscribed. I know for some times we do actually forget that you exist and we keep begging on new subscribers to do subscribe. But uh, I do cherish you. I thank you. And I believe and request that may God bless you for being with me and uh, showing me support. Uh, I need to get something. 
that I can use and uh, the material of choice is this but I need to get something to cut it down to the dimensions that I need and that is a scissor the question is where is the scissor the scissor has hidden but scissor is the perfect fella for this kind of task so let's find scissor as you guys are hitting that subscribe button and as I continue being grateful to you who are already subscribed you do actually mean a lot I do, do mean a lot you do mean a lot and uh, those who are returning to watch that means <laughs> you is already subscribed thank you and even you who is not yet subscribed but uh, you keep coming to this channel to watch me I thank you for being here I'm really grateful those views mean a lot okay so now I am going to see how I failed to get my scissor and therefore I'm using a surgical blade I am just hoping I can get the right size for my needs so this is going to have to press the screen down uh, right let me slice another piece okay that so it's supposed to cover over so I'm going to trim this down and then I think it should be sufficient for pressing down the screen connector into its socket